Hi everyone, this is Asma Mushtaq from the Double Vibes, and in this tutorial, we are going to perform an other experiment with this Pick Kit Development Board. Fine, and in this experiment, we will see that there is a switch connected at the fifth pin of port B, while a buzzer is connected with the zero pin of the port C. Okay, and what is the task or what is the objective of this problem? In this problem, if the switch is pressed, the buzzer should be turned on. And if I will release the switch, then the buzzer should turn off. Fine. And for understanding that, first of all, we need to see how the electric buzzer actually works. So a buzzer is a two terminal device. And when you will buy a buzzer, some of the buzzers will have a positive sign indicator indicating that this is the positive terminal while the other terminal will be grounded. Fine. Or if the positive sign is not marked, then the terminal that is larger as compared to the other one will be the positive terminal. Fine. So in this way, you actually identify the terminals of the buzzer and on the positive at the positive terminal, you need to connect the supply voltages plus 5 volts while the negative terminal is usually grounded fine and on this development board let me just uh, describe it more clearly you can see the different switches are connected this buzzer will be actually connected to the board when i will connect this junction with the pins so i need to close this junction fine in order to complete the circuitry just like it is shown over here so this j25 on the board is actually a junction that will connect the buzzer with the zeroth pin of rc or the port c all right and here rb5 is connected at the switch 2 so this is my switch 2 present fine and in order to use the switch 2, I need to connect the, this junction. Similarly, you can see different switches or you can use any of these switches. Fine for providing the input. Now, let's see how it works. But before that, this is the complete circuit diagram where you can see this is junction J25. This is the switch 2 while VCC is connected at the uh, and the switch is connected at the fifth pin of the port B and the zeroth pin of the port C is connected with the buzzer. Let's see how it works. So here I have written the code for performing the task. Bit set file register trace B comma file the five is actually the input pin fine where the switch is connected while the trace C comma zero is the output pin where actually we are connecting the buzzer okay then we keep monitoring the fifth pin of port b and if it is high then a high to low pulse will be set to the zero pin of port c to turn on the buzzer let's see how it works now so here you can see i have imported the code into the big microcontroller fine and uh, Let's just turn it on since the code has already been imported into the PIC microcontroller. So when I turned, on, uh, turned it on and this is actually the switch that will be used for turning on the buzzer. So when I will press it, the buzzer is turned on and when I release it, it is turned off. Again, I will give it a try and give it. Uh, let's just press it again. So when I press the switch, the buzzer is on and when I release it, it is turned off so in this way we can actually turn on or turn off the buzzer thank you for watching